Okay, so today I'm going to take you through a pose that's a standing forward fold. This is a great pose to do if maybe you've been a bit desk bound, um, you've got a bit of neck tension, maybe even a bit of a headache. I've got a bit of a headache today, so it's kind of what inspired me to do this one, if you could call it that. Uh, so what I would advise though, if you've got any disc problems, I would avoid this, but if your back is fine, let's go for it. So coming to a standing position, have your feet hip width apart. And think about grounding down through the feet. So maybe even here lifting the toes and lowering down from little toe to big toe. So we're really getting the weight into our heels and on the outer edge and the inner edge. Have your arms by your sides and gaze as soft as we inhale, rolling the shoulders up towards the ears, sliding them back down. Inhaling, another shoulder roll. Big deep breath. Exhaling, maybe even sighing. <sighs> Letting it all go. Bringing the hands onto the thighs. Knees are soft. They can be as bent as you need them to be. Start to forward fold. Sliding the hands down the legs. Now here you can have the hands resting on the shins or the feet, the floor, or maybe you've got a book or a brick. It's not about a hamstring stretch, so remember, keep the knees as bent as you need them to be. And here you can even hold opposite elbows. Letting the head be heavy not clenching the jaw, maybe even just shaking the head out, letting it go. Another option, you can interlace your hands behind your head. Breath is deep, breath is slow. Maybe rock side to side. Letting the body be soft. Be here for about six to eight breaths. If you have the interlace or holding opposite elbows, releasing the hands, pressing into the feet, slowly rolling up, vertebra by vertebra, head and neck, the last to come up. Inhaling, drawing the shoulders back up towards the ears, sliding them down the back, arms by sides. Just taking a moment. Feeling that relief, that release. Thank you.